This is Apple Tech Beast and this is the fourth video in the series of WWDC releases. Basically this one is about the amazing Mac Pro. Well, well I suppose it's amazing, but it's sort of not amazing because Apple haven't released one in about four years. They've upgraded some things on it, like tiny minor things on it. And it's pretty annoying and people were getting annoyed since it was Apple's most powerful computer basically. At WWDC they have released a new one and it is called the Mac Pro. I haven't changed the name but the design... <laughs> wow. That, it, basically the design is completely changed and the pictures there will show that and it is incredible. Uh, so I'm going to tell you some stuff about it now. So this new Mac Pro is going to be assembled in the USA which is amazing, as are more and more Apple products in the future, like Apple have said. I mean, not all of them are going to be made in uh, the USA because it costs too much, but um, it possibly means better build quality as there's going to be... It's going to be less, less mass-produced. It's going to still be mass-produced, obviously, but, you know, it's going to be made in the USA. It features up to 12-core Intel Xeon, Xeon processors. It has an 1866 MHz 60 GB per second RAM kind of crazy. It can support up to three 4K monitors and it has up to 528 gigabytes per second uh, graphics. Um, ah, it's quite good. Amazing. They haven't released prices for this, by the way, yet, as it was just apparently a sneak peek into it um, in WWDC because the audience was so special, even though it was on live stream, so there was like a million people watching it. It has two times performance of the previous generation, and I'll show you how big it is compared to the previous generation in a second. It is backwards compatible and it has 1.25 gigabytes per second read flash storage that is, that, that's IO is, um, no, sorry, that is 10 times faster than any Mac HDD. It is therefore arguably the best computer anyone could ever make. Well, technically not because I know people are going to say you can't, but that's why I say got arguably, but yeah. But like I said, they haven't released prices for this, so that might be the letdown, but I'm sure it won't be any more than £15,000 like the top Mac Pro now costs. Um, it is that size compared to the old model. That, that, that is it. That little round cylinder thing holds 12 cores. <laughs> wow. Um, but yeah, that's quite good. It's, th so that picture is basically showing that it's one whole eighth of the volume of the previous model. So that is quite good. So basically you could have it like on top of your desk. That's my desk by the way, I'm pointing to my desk. Um, on top of your desk instead of having to have like a whole massive space for it. Just the specs compared to the old model as well. Tw it's two times um, more, just generally two times faster than the old model and it's an eighth of the size. It also has the famous Mac Pro carry handle, which everyone wants, I mean, so you can carry it around. It has a pretty awesome physical feature also, which is when you turn the cyl cylindrical device around, it um, it sort of spins around on its own like axis sort of thing, and when you spin it around to uh, reveal the I.O., um, it kind of lights up. It lights up to show you where all the things are, like that picture shows, and that is pretty amazing. Um, but yeah. That was the teaser for the Mac Pro in WWDC, and it's going to be released later this year, apparently, according to Apple. So, yeah, basically all the things that people will care about in this video is the pictures. Do a couple more pictures now, and uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment, and like the Facebook page, which is Apple Tech Beast. Look at my you now if you know what you now is. Uh, all you have to do is sign up with Facebook, and then you can just follow me on you now. I think it's follow, but anyway, yeah, just do that, and uh, yeah, thank you for watching, I think the you and I is in the description, and so is my Facebook, and yeah, um, but yeah, thank you for watching, um, that was the uh, fourth video in the WWDC, WWDC releases video series thing, and yeah, thank you for watching, goodbye.